What's up guys, it's Brown again from Lake Acre Scuba and Marina and today we are doing a little bit of survey and diving. Uh, we are actually helping out some friends of ours, the guys down at Marine Construction. Um, they're repairing some docks that got damaged during the, the last big storm we had here on the lake. And so what we're doing today is we're going underwater and we're going to survey the poles of the dock, um, the conditions of the floats of the dock, and of course any um, boat lifts or anything like that that could have got damaged during the storm as well. So we're going to go down here do some um, surveying for them guys come up. We're going to document what we do. Of course you, you guys will see it here on YouTube but we're going to document what we're doing for them. That way they can get a good general idea of what they're looking at. That way they know if they need to replace stuff, if they can reuse poles and remount them and stuff like that or um, you know reinstall them down into the bottom, lake bottom. But stick around with us and we'll see what we get into today.
just broke off clean at the bottom of this. My feet. Okay. Yeah, here, I'll measure for you. It's a little shy of my arm span. Right yeah, I bet you they all have. This one goes to the bottom of a sleeve, tapers to a pipe, goes down again, tapers to another pipe, and goes all the way into the bottom at 20 feet. This one's touching bottom and it's good and secure.
next one over was good and secure. It was at 14 feet, dug deep in, everything. Yeah, that's the one I saw the other day. 22 feet to the bottom. The bottom of the sleeve was at 17 feet and it didn't look tapered. And we just saw another four foot catfish. I hope, I don't know. All right, guys, so we just got finished up with our little survey dive there. It wasn't too bad of a dive. It was actually very shallow. It was less than about 10 feet. Um, but our main goal today was is go down, just get a good general idea of what was under there, what type of damage was under the water, um, and, w and we did that. We was able to survey the poles, look at the poles, see what condition they were in. We actually did find a boat lift, so uh, being able to see the, the damage that was caused to the boat lift as it sank, um, not sure if it's going to be able to uh, be able to be reused. There's a big old cut right up the center of it where one of the um, lift brackets had cut through the air, uh, the air pocket itself or through the air cell of the boat lift. So we'll be able to show that footage to the guys and, and let them make their determination on whether they're going to be able to repair this stuff or have to build new. So guys, I appreciate you coming along on this dive with us. It just goes to show you we're not your typical dive shop. Yes, we run trips. Yes, we sell gear. Yes, we teach classes and we take dive trips and all this stuff, but we do a lot more. We do surveying. We do salvaging. Uh, of course, we do fun dives or treasure hunts and stuff, but I do appreciate you coming along on this dive with me. If you got any questions, simply put it down in the comment section below. Uh, as always, guys, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter, like us on Facebook, pin us on Pinterest, subscribe to us here on YouTube, and as always, guys, we appreciate your business.